Hello everyone. We are gonna do a summer skin bronzing moment with the beautiful Jennifer uh, Tulemil. I'm so excited to be doing this with you today. I am going to start with a little Vital Skin Foundation. For the freckles, I really like to keep them intact and especially you have no pores. I need glasses, but I don't need them for Jennifer because it's kind of like if I can't nail that, then I may as well call it a day. <laughs> so I'm gonna combine Vital Skin 6 and 4 because I like to use two shades of foundation really to kind of like still maintain the integrity of all of your tonality. Jennifer, in the summertime, what, what is your approach with your skin? Um, in August, I'll probably about be about four or five shades darker. Um, I find I pick up the sun even if I don't try, so I can just be walking down the street and I'll come inside and my, my skin tone has changed. As you said, you do get go a lot darker, so I'm gonna use our Beauty Butter Bronzer in our newest shade called Soleil Riche, which is a really gorgeous, deep terracotta with no shimmer. I go under the eye. I'm just like ever so gently going over your skin. So the Beauty Butter Bronzer is plant-based plant butters and it settles really beautifully into the skin which is really nice because it makes it feel like your skin as opposed to you know sitting on top of your skin and you look super makeup y so now I'm gonna use brulee which is a um, it's a highlight but it has warmth so it's really nice to kind of um, use across like your cheekbone and it's really pretty on your eyes and you can use it on your lips also which is pretty so you can just go kind of directly from the bullet to your skin. I'm gonna give you a little bit of nectar on your lips. Now I'm gonna give you a little bit of kind of a bronzy chocolatey eye. And again, not like super makeup-y, but just so it feels like it enhances everything, this whole idea of golden summer skin. So I'm gonna use our iPods in Les Jours. I'm gonna use this Chocolat color and taba, which is tobacco. And then I might just sprinkle in some of our neige. I feel like I'm a real minimal person when it comes to makeup. I like to just quickly throw something, something on. on. That's what we're that, doing here. That enhances what I've already got. That's our philosophy. <laughs> Without going over the top. It's all about yeah. amplifying what you have and not transforming you. So I'm going to start by giving you a little bit of taba. Let's see. And I'm not creating any specific, there's no kind of like cat eye or anything like that. It's more creating this idea of like a floaty eye. I'm gonna give you a tiny bit of neige with our eyeshadow two brush here. And the tear duct just to open that up and then also blending with these two shades together nicely. I'm giving the socket more of the chocolat for more definition. When I was younger, I used to pack on the makeup, cover my freckles. Um, I was lining up for Australia's Next Top Model back when I was 15. Then I was not very healthy um, in terms of I had disordered eating, that sort of thing. So my mom stepped in before I signed, pulled me out of it all, and I went to university. And it was my second year of university when my friends said, hey, there's this thing called plus size modeling, you should give it a go. And I got a contract straight away. And then from there, it just, I feel like it's just kind of snowballed. And now I'm living in New York. <laughs> like, how wild is that? <laughs> I was part of the full mm. campaign for Victoria's Secret, which was, I remember saying to some of my friends, I would love to, you know, move to New York. And these are the list of clients that I would love to work with. And when that happened, I was just, so shocked because I just didn't think that I could do that. I'm gonna add a little bit of our I Love You mascara. I'm popping on some Bichette baby cheeks just to give you like really pretty flush. I think actually brulee would be gorgeous on your lips. So I'm just gonna. I mean, how great is that? I just wanted to say thank you for watching and this is the gorgeous Jennifer Atilamil in summer skin. Simple, easy, and really does the trick. I was just saying before that I don't like the feeling of makeup on my skin and I don't feel like I'm wearing makeup. 
and I look amazing. So, you know, it's a win-win. <laughs> Thank you everyone for watching and um, let us know what you think. Okay, thanks, bye.